congrats, Jeff. Hey, it's Jody. Can you just <laughs> go through the final couple minutes there and uh, for for not practicing a whole lot and for for being a pretty good for being a pretty young new team together, uh, you, you executed down the end a little bit. You know what? I, I I thought we did a really nice job. We actually finally became a little patient. We were rushing things and. You know, in international be- basketball, you know, it's a 24 second shot clock. So it's not like you can make, you know, get four ball reversals out of something, but you can't try to do everything off the first pass. And as soon as we started to realize, hey, let's try to put some pressure on it, let's try to attack. If it's not there, kick out. Then we came out, set a ball screen, executed beautifully. We got a couple of nice layups, a nice pick and roll, uh, did, did some really good things. And I was excited for him because it it was fun because we're continuing to see somebody else step up in a different way. Nina Rickards was outstanding for us tonight. Uh, Seven assists, three turnovers, 10 boards. I mean, scores nine points. She was great. And, you know, that's what's exciting for me. We we did a much better job of throwing the ball into the post. We we, we got, oh, better looks. and it's just it's exciting to see the potential that we have and being able to to see the growth that I was able to see here in a week with only 10 days of practice. It's pretty encouraging. And if I can if I can get them to buy into playing just a little bit harder, especially our transfers, you know, Nyla, O, Riss, they know how hard you we, we play here. If I can get the other ones dialed in to realize, okay, I got to sprint every time. I got to put a body on somebody. It, it's it's going to be fun. I mean, it, it really is. And I'm excited to, to, to see what this group can become uh, come January, February, March. That was a big shot from Sydney there in the end. She didn't really, she did in the first half. Second half, she that was her only bucket, but it came at a big time. Can you kind of go through that and, and, like you said earlier in the week, she's really played well for you so far. Yeah, she has played well. I mean, and it, and it was a great pass. I think Jay, Jada threw through that to her on the inbounds, uh, and, and and she she hits a big one. But overall, I've just got to continue continue to get them all to realize they're not just scores. Like you know, I was really excited when Sid made that drive, made made a pass fake in the first half, scores a layup. Because she needs to be able be able to show everyone a more than just a three point shooter, and as she continues to mature and grow from in that area, it's going to open up those threes for her. And it, it, it was a huge shot she made. I mean, I mean, it, could, it. I will say every time one comes out of her hands, it it looks the same way. And I, I was just pleased. I, I was really pleased overall with the performance of everyone. Jeff, what kind of what do you what, how do you take this now and, and moving forward? Because you got ten practices in, you got four really you know two really competitive games, two other games that you were able to work on some things. Uh, now you've got you know a long time before the beginning of the season. How, how does this help moving forward? Do you feel like? Well, I think it gives them you know an idea of what we what we can be. I mean, the one thing I challenged them was we've got to rebound the ball better. We we got embarrassed against them in the first game. And it, it's not like they out-rebounded us by 20, but they came up with crucial rebounds. And tonight, we out-rebounded them by 14. And I was really, really pleased with how we put a body on the ball. Somebody's not muted. Sorry, Trey. Is that it's if, yeah? If you're not talking, if you can mute a little bit because we're hearing background noise. Anybody yep. else? Anything? Yeah. Oh, with that, when, are you going to sit back over? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Go, go. Go ahead, Jody. I'm sorry. You know, with with Nina, what? 
you talked the other day about when you know when Jada and Nina in there together, and, and she's probably going to have the you know she's probably going to have the ball kind of in her hand. What what do you what do you envision with her? She showed tonight, and I think the whole thing. I mean, she can a pass it, but um, but she can rebound it too. I mean, she's all around really. What, what do you kind of envision? for her kind of role on this team? Well, I think what you saw today is what she's what she's going to be able to do for us. Uh, you know, I think, like I've said, I think we can have four, five, six kids in double figures every single night. I mean, you've got Sydney with 15. You've got Kiki with eight. Nina with nine. Jada with nine. O with 14. I mean, you're one bucket away from having five players in double figures. Right. And I know not, Nyla can play can, can play better. You know, in a game like this, you know, she's always wanting to drive it, drive it. Well, that, that six, six, eight kid was like, come on, bring it in to me. You know, so as soon as she starts to get a little more confidence, which she's worked on it, her her eight to 10, 10, 10 foot jump shot looks hey, great. Hey guys, it's Sam with the blind spot. So I'm doing a follow up to the video Sorry, I, that one I just on? made about. Sorry, uh, Hooking up an right. HDMI splitter so you can watch TV right. on the couch Hello. with the family. Uh, a lot of people I've seen are having issues with HDMI, HDMI splitters. Split. I saw a bunch of reviews. <laughs> Thanks, Trey. Okay. Yeah, so I'm just really pleased with with, with everyone. I mean, uh, uh, Henny did not play a whole bunch tonight. That The game just didn't present itself. Uh, you know, we, we we go five guards, and that's kind, kind, kind of what gave us that nine-point lead in the first half. And then we just, because of the physicality of things, throwing it to the post and banging it, it you're not get, going to the free throw line a bunch. Uh, and that, that wasn't the answer. So we tried to spread the floor and drive it and get downhill as much as possible. Hey, Jeff, it's Dominique with WLKY. I was wanting to ask, throughout this tournament in this run was there anything that maybe did surprise you or something you weren't you know exactly sure you were going to see until you had this team on the court I mean no it was just you know as, as you go Dominic it's just trying to figure out like you know I've seen them all play individually with their teams in the past now it's trying trying to get them all together how are they going to gel together and how are they going to handle playing with other really good players so that I think is something that's still going to grow. You're going, we're going to see improvement. Uh, you know, my thing with Sid, which I keep talking to her about, is, you know, I'm, I'm looking for the efficiency. I'm looking for instead of going six for 21, can she go in a game to like tonight six for 15? Take take a few of them tough shots out that she took, uh, and just become more efficient. And I think she can do that. But we also missed some layups. I thought K- Kiki goes. Two for nine, but she had some that she, you know, she had been making throughout the tournament that just did not go in today. I guess, Jeff, it's just it is the summer. You you've said it over and over on this this week that it's July, it's July, but it's also nice to win. And this is a good. Can you guys kind of talk about this being a starting point moving forward? I know you've got a long time before that opening game. But uh, it's nice to win a championship. Oh, it sure is. I mean, you know, now I guess they can't say we can't win the big one. (laughs) 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 It's our championship, right? You know, uh, no, it's great. It's great for the kids. I mean, it's great for everyone, the staff, everybody. You know, we, we did this with the intention that we knew it was going to be important to get these 10 days of practice and then the opportunity to play international competition. And we got everything out of it that we wanted. It, it's kind of like I told CL today when we were talking after the game. Now, come November, December, nobody's going to care that who we play, that we won the gold at the Global Jam. You know, it, it, it's not going to get us three extra wins. But what it's, what it's done for us, it's, it's shown us that we're a group that's going to fight. We're not going to quit. And I've, I've, I've been impressed with that. You know, we got down 8, 45 to 37 there in the third quarter, cut that thing, I think, five or three going into the fourth, and then just continued to fight. You know, we're down four at the – it's 59 to 55 at, at the, the, the TV timeout, you know, in the fourth quarter, and kept grinding and grinding and grinding and, and – 
Jaden Curry made a, 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 a two, two, two big consecutive, two big shots for us in a row. Huge three from the corner, makes two free throws. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I'm just, I'm happy with where we are, but we definitely have room to grow, lots of room. I appreciate y'all guys. You guys are always, uh, I just appreciate you covering a, a women's basketball like y'all do. It, it means a lot to us here. Congratulations, Jeff. Congrats. Thanks. Thanks, guys. All right. Thank you all.